Hi, my name is Mario Marcus. I'm from the Detroit area, and I'm here to talk about a book. Everybody has their own opinion of what everything means about these organs, but there's a book called The Hammond Organ, Beauty and the Bee. It's got a picture of Jimmy Smith on it, and it tells you a lot about the Hammond organ. And I just want to take a minute to kind of go through some of this stuff just to show you about this book. You want to try and get this book. It talks about everything. Um, the Ford about the Hammond organ. It talks about Mr. Uh, Lawrence Hammond, the uh, originator of the Hammond organ. It talks about how he was a clockmaker and how he did the organ. And it tells you about the different types of Leslie's uh, uh, that we use. You know, it says, All Hell the King here is talking about the B3. I mean, it's a great book. It is really a great book. It shows you about how they created the organs in the factories, everything. Now, that's my favorite right there. That's a, a, a 122 Leslie. You know, I'm a Leslie fanatic. It talks about different musicians in it. It talks about pipe organs, how the draw bars represent the pipe size. You know, the 16-foot pipe, the 8-foot pipe, the 4-foot pipe, the 2-foot pipe, the 1-foot pipe, all these. You have nine different draw bars, and it tells you about each draw bar, what it really is. It's not about what sound, you know, what we think it should be, but it's about the pipe value. The Hammond organ is made in the image of a pipe organ. It has the pipe organ foundation. It talks about 25 pedal pedal boards, which is the flat pedal board. It talks about this concave, 32 foot um, sound, as well as the 32 pedals on the pedal board that go up in the, the little circle like that. I really admonish you to get the book. You really don't know anything about a Hammond until you've got this book, Beauty and the Bee. Because most of us who have lived long enough to know knows that there is a um, uh, owner's manual that comes with your book and it tells you everything about the book. It tells you about your instrument. Know your instrument, fellas and ladies. Know your instrument. I mean, it goes back to talk about how Hammond created a pipe, a digital pipe organ, one of the first, and it was a flop. It talks about, it tells you the different models, like this is a Model E 100, if I'm correct, it tells you, it says, production dates, 19, June 1965 to June 1970. The original selling price was 24.65. You know, I mean, it goes into a whole bunch of stuff. You, you all, some of y'all have D6, D152s and D100s, RT3s, which is the big organ with the big pedals and it's longer, but it's a B3. B3, C3, Anything with percussion on it is has the same insides, you know, and I really want you all to know that um, I could just go on and on and on and on. It talks about the phone wheel, the phone generator inside the organ, why you need to keep your organs lubricated, and it talks about Mr. Don Leslie. This dude here uh, is on this page, Mr. Don Leslie. He is the dude who created the, the Leslie speaker. He created the Leslie speaker because he wanted to emulate the sound of pipes being in a room. Because in an old pipe organ, pipes went along the side of the roof, along the side of the building. So you had echo chambers, you had 12 great chambers, you had pedal chambers. They were all in different parts of the room, and the sound just came around the room. Well, Mr. Leslie designed the Leslie in the, in the in the mind frame to say, we're going to throw the sound around the room to emulate a, a, a pipe organ. But it didn't do it. It was just something far greater than he ever thought about it. Whether you believe in that, Mr. Hammond did not like the sound of his organ. He said it was too muddy. It was too clunky. You can hear the key click when, when you play. You hear the, the undertones of the organ. And, but we loved it. He didn't. But, you know, hey, you know, we reserve the right to love what we want, and that's what we bought, and that's what the sound that everybody purchases. So I'm going to get off of here right now. Um, I'm going to tell you the ISBN number 
for this book is ISBN 0879304596. Okay, it's distributed by Hal Leonard Corporation. The book was $24. I'm going to put this up for you because I'm looking at the screen to make sure that you're seeing the stuff right. That is the ISBN number. And order the book. You will love the book. Have a blessed day.